This video is brought to you by BossRootin.com. Fight me, a fearless expression. What are you willing to fight for? And PowerPerformanceProducts.com, where you can receive $10 off your purchase of Body Storm and Body Effects. Spencer Lazari here at the Hilton alongside Mark Hominick. He's fighting Eddie Yagen at USC 145 this Saturday night here in Atlanta, Georgia. Obviously excited to get back in there for you. Huge fight, you know, like to be on this card especially. This is one of the biggest main events of the, of the year. And to be on the pay-per-view portion of this card is an honor. And, you know, I'm going to go out there and try and steal the show. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you are on the main card. It is a big card. But there has to be a somewhat a little disappointment that you're not fighting in your home country, Canada. You know, it was nice, but you know, with with uh, fighting in your home country and home province and what and whatnot, there's a lot of added pressure with the media demands, and and there, there's a lot of extra. So it's nice to for this fight is almost like I was flying under the radar and just had to focus on the uh, on the fight, uh, preparing and uh, showing up and throwing down. Saw some video of you getting work in with Jeff, Pat Curran, and those guys. Talk about what, what help they've been for you. It's been great. You know, Jeff's been a, a part of my training since about 2004. Uh, over the last few years, we've kind of lost touch with Sean uh, moving up to Vegas, but it's nice to kind of re rekindle that relationship. And, uh, you know, Pat, he's one of the best at 145 in the world, so he's been a good training partner. And Jeff, uh, he's similar sized to Eddie, so uh, he's at 5'6", so he's been a good sparring partner. And, and he's got a great mindset for, for the sport. He's been around for almost 15 years. Over 50 fights so he you know he knows the sport in and out and he knows myself in and out as well so another striker is that exciting to get to go do what you love to do and knowing that he's not going for a takedown this is gonna be a scrap you know like Eddie's one of those guys you know you can draw a line in the sand you know he'll meet you there uh, and you know it makes for an exciting fight and it, it, that's the kind of fight I get excited for that you know I, I you know I'm not he's not running from me he's there to throw down and we're, we're gonna steal the show do you want, though, to sort of use your movement and, and technique ability more? Because he does have a big overhand, right, like you mentioned, and, and, and some good power. So is there... You don't want to necessarily brawl with him. Well, there's no question. You know, there's there's a difference between you know saying they're slugging it out and 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 fighting tactical and still being in a war. And like you know, I I'm ready for that. But yeah, like I mean, my, I think my my technique's far better than his. But again, he's got that heavy power, the big right hand. So you know that plays into into it. I think distance is going to be a big thing in this fight. He's definitely gonna be trying to close it. I'm going to be trying to keep it. You know, he's he's five five or five six, and you know I, I believe I have uh, reach distance and footwork on him. So uh, you know it's, it's going to be a bit of a chess match. But yeah, you know. Know, it's going to be like playing with the uh, the snake. <laughs> you had a great performance uh, against the title fight, I thought, against Jose Aldo. We talked after that fight. And then, of course, the, the short performance that you, you're not happy with, I'm sure, in your last fight. So do you feel any added pressure to get in there and make sure that you, you come out with a W? I think there's added pressure in every single fight, you know, like, and I think that's the mindset any any fighter in the UFC should have is that, you know, your back's against the wall every time. You have Because UFC, they really pride themselves on, on promoting the fighters and, and promoting the athletes who, who laid on the line. And I believe I'm one of those fighters. You know, the last fight that you know the learning experience I took from it is that I fought out of character you know I came out so reckless so uh, aggressive that you know I threw a wild leaping punch and I took a counter right hand so out of character for me and again I had to learn a beginner experience 10 years into my career but you know I, I, I didn't want to dwell on it too much right back to the gym right back at focus of, of climbing forward yeah that's a little bit of the beauty of the sport I suppose but where do you feel like your striking ability still fits in at the 145 pound division honestly I think I you know I'm, I'm the best in this division to Technically, um, you know, Aldo, Aldo's got a lot of power. He's, he's very explosive. He's up there. Uh, there's there's a few strikers, but I think, you know, technically I'm, I'm the best. And But uh, the, the, you can talk all you want. I think you have to go there and prove it, and that's what I'm going to do. Well, your focus is obviously on this fight. What fights jump out, and what are your goals? I know you want to get back to that title shot, of course, moving forward. You know, I this is the this is a fight where I like this is where it starts and finishes right now. You know, like I'll worry about Sunday on Sunday. You know, Saturday night. It, this is the most important fight in my career right now, and, and I'm going. I'm treating it like that. Uh, the training camp has been focused around that, and that that's what it is. You know, I have to lay it on the line and prove that you know I belong amongst the top. And the way I do that, I go out there and win. Okay. Appreciate the time. This is Mark Hominick. I'm Spencer Lazara. You're watching MMAinterviews.tv. Look for his fight on the main card, UFC 145, this Saturday night. Hey there, we're the King of the Cage Green Girls. Thanks for watching MMAinterviews.tv. Godspeed and party on.